back to another video. What do we got here today? Oh. I see a big shadow right there. What's up, buddy? Peekaboo. <laughs> <laughs> That's the, probably the worst entrance I've ever heard in a video. Thanks, buddy. Great work. That's hot. Sick mom stance, bro. Thanks. <laughs> Somebody in trouble? Now Ryan. So I know typically most of the videos we do on this channel are diesel truck related, but a lot of you guys own gas trucks. Like our good buddy Chris over... You like my sweet tower I made? Yeah. Or like our good buddy Chris. Chris, how do you enjoy the gas truck life? I love it. I don't need a diesel. He doesn't need a diesel. Suck. Well, easy guy, easy guy, easy guy. At C Bailey six one nine, I'll put it down in the description. Feel free to go light him up for that comment. So we're gonna do a video on a little addition Chris has done to his truck. But before we get to that, we really stirred up a lot of crap yesterday with the video I posted about two foot driving, two feet driving, two foot, two feet, two feet, two foot, two footed, two foot, two feet stist, two foot driving, and. I, I don't know if I expected the crazy backlash. I mean, nobody's still giving me a real good reason as to why it's a bad idea, but I've got a good comparison. Chris, I need to borrow you for a second, buddy. This will, this will give a good kind of rundown as to the difference between one-footed and two-footed people. So it seems like a lot of people really have a disconnect when it comes to two-footed driving, and a lot of people couldn't really wrap their mind around it. They said they tried it and it just doesn't make any sense. Their left foot doesn't do what they want it to do. And to me, that's kind of the, the perfect analogy that we're gonna come Oh. Oh. Nice use of the shoe rack. <laughs> so, I think the perfect example of that is right there, the piano. 99% of the world that doesn't play piano, you say, hey, go play a song on the piano, and they're going to play like Chris is probably going to play right now. Chris, go play a song on the piano. What? Really? Yeah. No. All right, Chris, now play with two hands. Like, like, play the other half of that song with two hands. Play one song where you gotta play separate with the right hand and the left hand. I, I don't know how to play the piano. <laughs> Most people can't get their two hands to work together, right? Especially on piano. This is like a, like I said, perfect example. Just in the same way that most people can't get their two feet to work together. If you want to use two feet, aka two hands, like just like on the piano, it's like it's a whole different ballgame. person to do it. That's all. What, what you... I was trying to clap. With oh, you're trying, trying to clap and hold the camera? Yeah, yeah. That doesn't really work. Okay. All right. So I think with that, we'll just let the whole two foot driving thing die. But hey, buddy, let's jump into today's video. You ready? Let's roll. Oh, what's up, buddy? Do we get some new boots? Yep. Whoa. It's going dark brown now, huh? There you go. So everybody that always asks what boots I wear, Chris wears the same boots. <laughs> yeah, right. They are Wolverines. I rock them in the, the reddish -er leather color. I've never owned the brown ones, but this is them in brown. So hey buddy, what'd you do to this thing? What was, what was your little little Christmas gift? Well, oh, Santa, Santa said I was good this year, so he, he gave me something to make my truck. Go fast. I got this thing that's called a pedal commander. A pedal commander? A what pedal. is that? Well, it just makes you go fast. Now let me show you. Okay. Let me pull it out. All right, let's pull it out. Oh, oh. Fit up underneath there, buddy? Oh, you got it. You got it. You get it? Yep. Oh, oh they give you a nice long cable. So this is a pedal commander. This is a pedal commander. All right, Chris, so, tell us what the pedal commander does. Well, pretty much what it does is it gives you better throttle response off the line. There's th four different levels. There's economy mode where, I guess, they say you get up to 20% extra better or better gas mileage. And you have city. I guess that's what everybody runs. It's kind of normal. And they got the, the sport. Gives you a little bit better throttle response. And then sport plus is like race mode. But um, 
basically what it does it gives you better throttle response it doesn't give you any more horsepower but everybody says it feels like you get more horsepower so basically it is plugged in line yeah where, where, where are you plugging it in well you do is you i don't know what the hell it's called but you the heart i guess the pedal harness you yeah. unplug that and uh you plug this in and it so it's kind of runs in line yeah runs in line and um it just gives a faster response to the throttle body so the thing with gas trucks is you know the reason i like diesel so much is literally an off-the-shelf tuner basically i mean that doesn't really exist but basically you can take a tuner and you can boost your diesel truck 200 horsepower all day long really no issues uh with a gas truck it's a lot harder to gain that extra horsepower you're relying more on mechanical bolt-on parts so little things you can do such as a pedal commander uh, uh you know they have tuners for gas trucks i think they gain you like 50 to 70 more horsepower not a whole lot uh you know little things you can do like that to a gas truck are great otherwise you're jumping into like super high dollar stuff like supercharging it like he wants to do pro charger pro charger pro charger so what does the pedal commander cost buddy a regular one costs like 200 bucks that one is bluetooth so i can run it off my phone i think that's close to 300. all right let's see what the app looks like so looking at the control panel here you can actually switch it on here right yeah but so i'm guessing if you don't get the bluetooth model this is what you have to like either stick it, somewhere yeah they give you a double-sided tape and you can stick it somewhere right there or that's kind of it's kind of janky i don't like the look of stuff like that yeah stuck somewhere that's why i got the bluetooth all right well let's let's see the bluetooth truck so right now i have it at at sport Ooh. and have it on the so i guess there's um on each so thank you so much I can't help it, man, okay? My dad shakes, my brother shakes, I shake. Okay. Leave me alone. So, so it's the family heritage or what? <laughs> yes. Okay, fair. You got your four settings right there. Okay. And each setting has, I guess, eight other settings. Oh, good. <laughs> so. So we're not really sure. We're not really sure. But you say I it mean, works. It, I mean, yeah, let's. Um, Put it back to stock. Yeah, that, that takes a while to get up. Yeah. All right, so going lowest to stock, and this is actually an improvement on stock. This thing takes a good minute to get moving. So now, let's bump it up. Where so do you- is there, a, is there a stop sign coming up? There's a stop light. Oh, pull over so we can switch it up. I'm not 100% sure if you can actually- Do it on the fly? Do it on the fly. I don't see I mean, why you wouldn't sure. be able to do it on the fly. Let me try it. All right. Well, so go to, let's go to, Sport. I'd leave it as regular sport. Regular sport. Okay, so I'm switching everything on the actual controller versus on the Bluetooth app right now just because it's handy right here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I see you. I see you. Here we go. <laughs> yeah, dude. Holy crap. That's, that's impressive for this little thingy. <laughs> She's quick now, dude. Now, I need you to go out, like, I need you to stop completely. And when you have it all the way to Sport Plus. Oh, you want to go Sport Plus? What are you at? Sport. Right. Really? We're at Sport Plus, ready? <laughs> Watch out, Robbie Gordon! I just want to show you how sensitive the throttle is when you have it. That's Sport Plus? Sport Plus turned all the way up. Oh yeah, we had Sport Plus not turned all the way up. <laughs> <laughs> Dang! Like that's literally me barely rolling on the throttle right there. Holy crap. That's like almost dangerous. It, 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 yeah. Just to build a truck off. You can do that too? Yeah. On this? Yeah. I want a rematch. You want a race rematch? Yes, because I didn't put it on fucking traction control off. I didn't put it to <laughs> whatever the other thing that Mr. Eddie told you to do. That's not Cheater. my fault. Oh my God, dude, the throttle's so sensitive. Ah. Dude, this thing's like a whole new truck. That, it, it's weird because it's not gaining, you're not gaining any horsepower. It's just, yeah, it's all in the in the throttle response from takeoff, but how long do you think these back tires are gonna last now? 
laughing. <laughs> oh my easy, god. Easy, easy, <laughs> easy. Jesus, easy. <laughs> yeah, bro, let me burn these tires off. We'll get you some new tires. Dude, that throttle is so touchy. Oh my god. Like, that is legitimately, like, a bad idea. I love this truck. <laughs> I absolutely love this truck. Are you sweating, buddy? Yes. <laughs> oh, we, we need some. We need some gas. <laughs> oh my god, dude, this truck is awesome. I'm back in love with this truck. What? Oh my god, dude. What? You just kicked me down right now, and it legitimately felt like the truck shut off. Like, that's how little response there was after you just shut, kicked it down. <laughs> like, legitimately, I thought the truck just shut off because we're so low on fuel. I was like, oh, well, there it goes. We just ran out of gas. <laughs> oh, my God. This thing's a turtle now. Holy crap. That's a huge difference. Like, and that's not like I'm just making this up for you guys because I'm trying to sell pedal commanders because I got no stake in pedal commander nor do I know a whole lot about these gas truck little tricks, but Pedal Commander did an amazing job with this little piece of hardware they got here. This thing is absolutely killer. Are you gonna drive this truck more now, buddy? No. No? No. Why not? I like to keep the miles down. I don't need to drive this truck, I got a company truck. Big time. There's an orange Lamborghini over there, can we race him? <laughs> Where's he at? Oh, oh, you can't see him, he's hidden behind those cars. Let's challenge him. I think you can take him. I think we'll get him off the line. Nice. Oh, you get an upgrade? Show everybody the app. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, you can really mess with somebody driving by doing that. Like, just don't tell them you have control over it. You just switch it on them when they're driving. This is insane. Well, I mean, if you have this setting on so, like on this truck, and like someone drives it for the first time, like it, that's it's dangerous. Oh, dude, the freaking Sport Plus turned all the way up. Yeah, dude, somebody's gonna plow right well, in the back of somebody. That's what I did the first time I programmed. <laughs> so we've got the check engine light on. The truck just said engine power reduced. What do we do to this thing, bro? What did, what did you do? I didn't do anything. Oh. <laughs> Maybe this pedal commander wasn't a good idea. Uh-oh. I'm hoping it's because we're so low on gas, but I, that doesn't make sense. I've never seen a truck do that. Uh, Is it still on? Let's put traction control back on it. Huh. All right, well, let's go get some gas, buddy, and hope that problem goes away. Dude, well, what's going on with this thing? Like it's shifting all weird. Uh, this is why we can't have nice things. Sorry, buddy. I don't know what happened, but sorry, buddy. The truck has like no power right now. And that's happening. The tranny's like shifting really weird. Uh. Okay, let's see if turning the truck off and back on helps. Let me turn that thing off. Uh, should I turn, turn it back on now? Hey, you know what, dog? This tank's on me, buddy. I got you, buddy. <laughs> here. Yeah. This tank of gas is on me. I got you, buddy. Oh, maybe if we put some V power in this bad boy. I think the truck just got confused. I think it did. I think I, I hope the truck just got confused. I got an old. Don't let Ryan drive your truck. <laughs> I didn't do nothing. This thing worked perfectly fine. I thought it was a, a race truck. Now uh, I used it as a race truck, and it didn't do that shit to me. Well, I think we were just changing the settings too much. I that's, think that's what I think happened. I think we're changing settings too much. I think I was changing it. You're changing at the same time. Yeah, I think we confused it. I, I hope. <laughs> yeah, me too. Anybody got a flatbed trailer? <laughs> <laughs> Go, GoFundMe.com <laughs> slash at CBailey619. Marvin his truck K. Mix. Brown, are you open today? <laughs>
<laughs> oh, bro, we're at a service center that's kind of open. They got a half a bay door open over there. Maybe we can... You know how you guys say in like a lot of the older videos, Chris always looked like he wanted to punch me in the background? This might be one of those times. He won't even look at me. We just need a, a fresh tank of some shell with V-Power. Oh, has V-Power? Oh, I got the V-Power. Yeah. Oh, yeah, man. I didn't cheap out on this tank of gas for you. It's the moment of truth. Uh, care, to, care to join me in a little... See what happens. Uh -oh. Now that check engine light, I mean, that thing like is always on, right? No. Hmm. Well, we got a bit of an issue. The problem is Preston's it's closed now, so we can't go borrow their scanner. Eddie's out of town, we can't go borrow his scanner. All we can do is see if she drives normal. Yeah, it doesn't feel like we're in reduced power mode anymore. Maybe it's time we gotta upgrade to a diesel. No. All right, All right let's see. All right, she's back to shifting normal. That's a good sign. Driving normal. I mean, all the temps are normal. Oil pressure is normal. Everything now it's back to normal. Now we gotta fight, figure out why that check engine lights on. There's too many computers on these things. I mean, <laughs> I was sitting here playing the damn thing like it was a video game. You were sitting there <laughs> playing it like a video game. Yeah, I don't know if that's like. It's not a two controller console. I guess it's just. Oh, know, it's not two player. It's not two player. <laughs> uh -huh. Well, either way, the good news is it's driving back to normal. It sounds normal. It's shifting normal. Is it about that Pro Charger? <laughs> Screw it. Screw it. <laughs> Engine's already tow, so let's just no. upgrade. No. All right, we can fully build this thing. What's a, what's a Pro Charger go for on these bad boys? Um, I went on the actual company Pro Chargers website, and I think it was around six thousand bucks. That's not that bad. No. Figured another thousand for install. install. Well, maybe if Pro Charger's listening, you know, you know, we'll get a little. Oh, Chris, Chris is winking behind the sunglasses there. <laughs> maybe we can get a little, uh, you know, a little, little Pro Charger for the channel. I think that'd be cool. Get the hell out of my truck. <laughs> Here you go, buddy. Negatory. Negatory, okay. Uh, then disconnect his battery. Uh, disconnect both terminals. Turn them, disconnect both terminals. Hi, Eddie. And, and uh, leave, those, leave them off for like a minute. And usually that will delete, take away the check engine light. But what's going to happen, it's going to wipe out all his monitors too. What monitors? His readiness monitor. So if, if he's like, if it's smog time, he's got to get a smog or something anytime soon. No. Does he smog anytime soon? No. Okay, then he's good. Then, yeah, then just unplug the battery, disconnect all terminals, leave them off for like, I don't know, a minute. Hi, buddy, what are you doing? Uh, I was praying. Did it work? No. So really we think what happened is we think we confused it. Chris was playing with the Bluetooth app, I was playing with the controller, kind of at the same time, messing around with the settings, and I think it, it just went into error mode and put the truck into limp mode. The truck completely cut power. Um, that's why it was shifting weird. I think it didn't want us to be able to shift into second gear. It didn't want us to go that fast. But once we turned the truck off, turned the truck back on, everything seemed to go back to normal other than the fact that the check engine light is still on. Um, so we're gonna have to run up to Eddie's at some point this week when he gets back from the desert. We'll hook it up to the scanner and we'll see just exactly what code was triggered. We can disconnect the battery right now and that will usually take that check engine light off according to Eddie. But I'd rather actually have the code scanned so we know that it was something that confused it or something majorly went wrong. Hey buddy, think, you, think he's got room for one more? Alright. <laughs> can we hook this one up too? This one broke down. Well guys, I have to say, aside from the issues that we ran into, and Chris, uh, I'm sorry about that buddy. I mean, it is what it is. the thing we do on this channel is we, we try and test out the products, you know, and sometimes Things go wrong. Luckily, the truck's running good now. Uh, we'll figure out what that code is in probably another video here, but we'll get this thing all dialed in. But uh, aside from the issues we ran into, I mean, I guess if you're just driving normally and don't turn your truck into a race truck, 
the uh, the pedal commander is actually an impressive difference for what it is. I'll see if I can find a link for you guys on Amazon. I'll put it down in the info below if you guys want to get one for your truck. Uh, like I said, I think we had the anomaly here of just driving this thing a little bit too hard and causing issues. Chris, anything you'd like to say, buddy? Roll the outro. Like you're just over this video? <laughs> on to the next one. You're done, buddy. You're done. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. No, nah, I don't care. I mean, it's back to normal. It's just, just removing the check engine light. We'll get it happen. Yeah, listen, I'll take it for you this week to Eddie's house. Oh, okay. I'll drive normally. <laughs> no, you won't. I'm going to see a video of you and Eddie doing donuts in my truck. All right, guys. As always, thank you so much for watching my channel. If you have not subscribed, please click the subscribe button now. That way you do not miss out on whether or not we get Chris's truck back to normal. Uh, don't forget to give this video a like, aka a thumbs up for our good buddy Chris because he, he needs a little pick-me-up after we may or may not have destroyed his truck. You need a hug, buddy? No. Come on, bring it in. Come, come on, bring, bring it in. Bring, bring it in. Sorry, buddy. I'm sorry. It's all good. All right, thanks, buddy. He's a great friend. You're a great friend, Chris. Oh, this is wild. No. <laughs> don't forget to check out WorkForWardApparel.com because if there's anything you want in this life, like... Oh. No, don't... Dirty Max Jack, where you at? <laughs> there go, you follow, go follow that guy. Uh, he won't ruin your he, truck? He's giving away a truck. There you go. <laughs> also, yeah, don't, don't forget don't, to check he out He ain't our, breaking trucks. He's giving away trucks. <laughs> don't forget to check out our buddy Jack's brand as well. He's about to release his giant giveaway that he's doing. Uh, don't forget, we've got all the Work For It sweatshirts back in stock. The link will be down in the description as well as the Pedal Commander link and a couple other links for you guys to check out. You guys are the best. We really appreciate you watching. Go ahead, buddy. Roll the outro. Damn. Uh. Yeah. Uh. Yeah.